Hey everyone, welcome back to the Dark Souls 3, or excuse me, Dark Souls 2! I got used to saying Dark Souls 3 so much. Dark Souls 2, Scholar of the First Sin. Walk through, lore through series. This is episode 3, and we're at the Crestfallen's Retreat. Now we're ready to begin the game. Now we're ready. couple of little hidden areas in this uh I got shooting arrows at us. Try to knock him out first. Before this guy gets over here. Uh oh. Got lucky. Drop your gear so I can get some more. No? Okay. Oh. Next up. Another one in the water, right there. What a swarm. Ah, well, maybe I don't remember. Now, this part. We want to kite these guys. There's a lot of them right here. We want to wake some of these guys up. them come down one by one. Kill them on the door on the ladder. Because there's some archers up there that will screw with you. Bombs at us. Want to be careful. Life jump. Down here. To make it safer. No need to take chances. This game gives you the opportunity opportunity to cheese a little bit. You do it because uh, it is a little unforgiving. Um, it's it's different than uh, the rest of Souls games. How did you... At least we got a life jump. I was hoping to get one of their armors. Um, now, we want to go this way. Take care of them. Got him. That's a jump we have to make later. 
Oh, that's right. <laughs> died there. Did get his hall infantry armor, though. Awesome. Um, I need to be very careful here, because I make that jump. Um, let's jump first. Got it. Get the soul of the name of soldier and a throwing knife. Awesome. Alright. I think there's one more item I've got to get because I dropped off. like to top myself off with the life gems, because you get so many of them, so. Always try to use those before you use Estus if you can. And... Yeah, I gotta jump this. Okay. We got it. Alright. Short sword and soul. The Lost Undead. Yay! Platforming complete. How can we forward? Got everything here, yep. They're actually in the base game of this, but there used to be a, uh... Um... Aid pipe there. I always used to farm that guy to try to get his, uh, armor, because I love the Aid Knight set. So yeah, we want to go this way first. around because I want to get the first bonfire coming up. Snake behind this guy. Get him. here, because there's going to be someone firing at you. Try to get him here. Now. Wow, he got me. How did he get me? Crazy. I'm talking about the hitboxes in this game. Careful from him. Down here. Health. Keep your guard up. 
Ah, yes, you. Buckler. Ooh, he got me. Through there's our on fire. Witching urn. Read all the lore on this stuff soon. Yeah, and we got a nice summon sign here. She will come back to Majula with us. After we beat this area. We want to buy a couple things from her. She has the key to Leningrass of Majula. Of the blacksmith. Majula is a land of exiles was compromised that abandoned old house of which Leningrass was fashioned into a workshop. Um, we also want to eventually buy one of these and one of these. This is what, uh, the Fragrant Branch of Yore is what turns, um, that person into, uh, back to a human from a stone. A fragrant tree branch that faint sweet smell restores the life of things turned to stone. Extended inhal in inhalation of the branch's scent can lead to a coughing of nausea. And, uh, I do want to eventually buy a Fairway Lock Stone. My name is Malentia. Malentia. Love her. <laughs> Get as strange as these days, everybody's gone and run off. <laughs> Drang Lake's been a pile of rubble since the war, thought long, long ago. And the giants crossed the sea. It seemed like the battles would never end. Poor folk like myself in an area place to sleep. Keep all me things right with me. You may travel light, but me thinks you bear a burden of your own. <laughs> they say these trees grew from the remains of the giants. From each carcass sprouted new life grown into what you see now. But you know what they also say? Don't believe what an old hag says. <laughs> it's high time that I pick up and move. Up a bargain for you. Next time we meet that up. It's high time. And that's all she says. Yeah. You're very welcome. Thank you. Let's go up here before we continue on forward. So this is locked, right? And actually just break it down. Swords at rest, so I'm gonna actually go rest. Yeah, weapon durability is a real thing in this game. Once we beat the first boss in this area, she'll move to Majula. Powder. You 
can actually, you should bring a torch here. Actually, what I want to do is... That's what I want to do. Gotta do it. Sorry, guys. Wow. Completely forgot about him. Oh, nice. Need the fireball. And small white soapstone and radiant light. Divine blessing. Oh, actually, I thought. Skin Estes Shard. Just sworn there was one. Maybe they. Maybe that was in the base game. Um, before they made Scholar of the First Sin. before we continue forward. We're gonna go down here now. Actually, how we can we can just get back up through here. Don't want to do yet. Human effigy. Wheat. On the first try. Great. Turtle up there. Giant ninja turtle there. That was stupid. I 
that's how you beat him. And we got his armor. Heck yeah! Your foot soldier sword here. I don't know if it's worth it, but good stuff. but I need to up my stamina we can get an awesome sword, the Fire Long Sword, if we go this way, but you gotta be real careful. Straight sword is sufficient in most respects and effective in most situations if wielded properly. Those who aspire a master sword are certain to wield this at some point during their journey. Oh, we don't have the stats for it? Oh, I need to level up my uh, decks. That's, that's, that's okay. Wait for the thing to finish. And we're done with this area. We actually will come back to it later. Over there. Right now we're good. Actually, you know what? Instead of wasting this, I'm just gonna use a uh, homeward bone. We can go back and deal with all that, but I'm not gonna do that, so. Just use it. We have nine. Why not, right? Save time. Let's uh, actually head back to Majula and open the backsmith uh, door. Fire long sword. Open this. And, uh, get this treasure right here. A short bow. Hurrah for Arthas. Yes, hurrah, big hurrah. Let's talk to him. Ah, oh, yes, very good. Now I can get to work. But first, let me set up. Come again, Legion. Before he rests, he should be in his 
will reset the world state. Notice how this bonfire is called the Far Fire. Very interesting. Now. You them. Stand back. This is dangerous work. The name's Lenigrast. Just a simple blacksmith. And you are? Oh. Uh, ah. Uh, another useless traveler. Ouch. A man ought to labor with his feet planted firmly in the earth. Not roll around like you flirtatious vagabonds. Well, what does it matter? Go on, show me what you've got. You're equipped. Let me have a look. But do it quick. We can buy from him, which is nice. Get a battle axe, which is nice. Get the rapier, which I thought about doing dual rapier build, but I'm still thinking about that. I don't know. I don't think I'll do that. He can repair and also reinforce. We actually do have a titanite shard. We have three of them. And I'm contemplating using it on fire sword, which I think I will. Um. Because I really don't have any other options that are better. So. I'll be around. Okay, Hunter, so that's good. So he has a daughter. He hints at her right here. <laughs> now, there's a time for travels, but you can't wander the world forever. Even you must have someone waiting. Drat. <laughs> You're worse than my reckless daughter. Don't spend your whole life. You'll need souls to. Okay, that's all he says. I'll be around if you make it back. We've upgraded our gear. Um, I don't think this key... I always forgot. I don't think this key opens this. Be sure it doesn't. No. That's right, I forgot where we go. Need to work on Vigor next. And adaptability, so I can get more iframes. I may just make this a quality, but we'll see. Uh, guys, that'll wrap it up for this episode. Thank you so much for watching. Please like, comment, subscribe, share. It really helps out the channel, and we'll continue on in the next one. Take care.